We finally hit 10,000 10, subscribers. <laughs> These guys are like, why don't we go for the third? Me veo así porque estoy haciendo las cosas bien. To think that your kid is never gonna... Okay, maybe, I don't know, maybe I shouldn't say this. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, people getting mad. Ay, no, tus hijos no están en paz. Por mi mamá no está cambiando de azúcar todo el pinche día. It wasn't even that bad. You were exaggerating. I hate that you did... I hate how exaggerated you are. Like, one day my boss comes up to me and she's like, Yeah, I saw you on YouTube. And I'm just like... Oh. <laughs> video today me and Anna were doing something that we actually have been planning to do this for freaking months but I got you guys we we're a little bit scared <laughs> <laughs> we're so used to we I feel like we're so simple we eat the sense of every day that we're so afraid to try new things but welcome to the YouTube video welcome to the family family we we're not doing a vlog today we're doing actually it's a celebration y'all Celebration video at last, we're trying something new today. Us, the Lumele family, we finally hit 10,000 subscribers. That is insane, I cannot believe it. I don't know how you feel about it. Me personally, it's like, whoa. 10k like I know it's not a lot I feel like for a lot of youtubers but like I never thought because I've been doing YouTube since we've been doing YouTube that I will be able to say we hit 10,000 subscribers probably by the time we post this I think we're a little bit higher than that I don't want to jinx it so I'm not gonna say a number but I think we're a little higher than that so we're gonna be trying Indian food honestly I I was like trying that. to back out like so many times so I was like no like I just I, I don't like trying new things it's the weekend it's our cheat meal like, do I really want to ruin that? <laughs> I mean, we'll see how it goes. It I looks look, good. I look, it smells good, but the smell is something different. I don't know how yeah. to describe it. I don't know. I, I want to say garlic, but it's not garlic. I, it's I just very strong. I don't know. I can't describe it either. But I mean, I don't know if you guys see me. But I don't know. So we're going to start with the appetizers, and then we're going to work our way down. I don't know how do you eat this stuff we don't know that's just a regular that just looks like a regular so what we got for appetizers was is they're called samosas yeah samosas yeah so I don't samosas. know I have no idea what this is is this pesto no I'm pretty sure this is not pesto this is not Italian <laughs> okay uh, they, yeah I don't know what this is it, it looks like this it's like it looks like two what are those things that you the, it looks like the Chinese it looks like the Chinese I don't even know what they're called. I haven't eaten Chinese food in such a long time. Those little things you the eat with, wonton thingies. You eat with the thing I no, what are they called? They're not dumplings. Dumplings, they look like dumplings. No. Oh, the cookies. No. Ra ragoons? No. A raccoon? No, what, am I saying that right? Or, I don't know. Yeah, I think so. They, you get them on like a Panda Express. They're, they're, it's like the, they have like meat inside of them and they're deep fried. That's what makes them different than a dumpling because these are deep fried. An egg roll? Like a roll? It's kind of like an egg roll, but it, it's different because this, this probably has meat in it. I don't know. I don't know. So per Google, a samosa is just stuffed with savory filling. So it could be meat. It just know. doesn't say. It just says it could it, it could be a lot of things, but it's more like a savory. So it's if it has meat, it's gonna suck. Cause Anna doesn't eat red meat. <laughs> <laughs> so, but the, I think so. Let's open these so we can try it. And then, so we got these. I want to try this first because I, I want it cold. So we got two mango Lassi. mango drinks. <laughs> <laughs> Are you already trying it? So a mango lassi is a popular creamy Indian drink made of a recipe of sweet mangoes, yogurt. Oh, I, I, I was right. It tastes like yogurt. It tastes like yogurt? Mm -hmm. Yogurt, milk like cream, ground cardamom, and a little bit of sweetener. It's mango heaven. Mm. I'm not... This is good. This shit thick. Damn, she is thick as fuck. But I want to I want to throw it into the freezer, let it, let it get a little bit frozen, and you know eat it like that. It's thick. Mm -hmm. It's really good though. Just like really good, really good. Esta madre sabe como cuando hago una milkshake. Not that, but like a milkshake, I make them thick as fuck. Why are you swallowing so hard? Chill out. Estoy emocionado. Ahí va bien la cosa. Okay, me gustó el yogur. 
Are you going to try it first with the sauces? Or I no? want you to try it first and bite it and tell me what's in there because I didn't even think of that. I just assumed that it was... Everything is chicken. Is it, is it Indian on. food, like vegetarian? The, when I looked it up, we door dashed this. So when I looked it up, there was a vegetarian side and then a regular Indian like dirt. No, but what I'm trying to say isn't it isn't it just like mostly chicken? This is all chicken. I know. Well, just you try. Let, it let me take a bite of it. Take so a, this is what it looks like. Okay. It's not that chill. Okay. You have to dip it into the stuff. Is it? Well, that's spicy. Is it? It's like lentil. It's like lentil. That's spicy. Try it with that stuff. Uh, is this supposed to be for? I don't even know. Actually, is this supposed to be dipped with that? No. Try it out. It's a better name. Oh, that's spicy. Mmm, that's sweet. No, you gotta try the filling. You don't need the coating. No, I tried it. I don't even know. I does it, it we're probably not even eating this right. Is it supposed to be eaten with this? I like this. Very good. But is this good? I don't know Dude. What? Why can I not taste nothing? The kids started getting sick when, like on Thursday, Tuesday? Like on Tuesday, the kids got sick and they got all of us sick. No, honestly, this kind of reminds me of a green salsa. Like, throw some salsa. <laughs> <laughs> like, it has potential. To me, this this, this red one, it looks like a lot of oil on it, but this red one is really good. I need to get a better taste of this. I don't know what this is, look it up. I want to know. It's like cilantro or what? This one doesn't taste like nothing. This one's spicy. Oh my god. This one's pretty good. This one, this is good. The samosa, solid. Solid for me. But yeah guys, the kids have been sick and they got us all, all of us sick. Which makes no sense. I don't even know how they got sick. It's so hot. I know they got sick. Oh. I'm not gonna, I'm not oh gonna. my <laughs> goodness, I already know what you're gonna I'm say. I'm not gonna disclose that information in this video. It has to do with the fan and the AC. <laughs> <laughs> I was pretty sick like a few days. I feel like I'm getting a little better, but I just know I hate it doing like the mocos. I have it like, like I hate that crap so much. I wasn't sick. So on Thursday, we woke up. He woke up kind of sick. Thursday, was it Thursday? Yeah. Friday I woke up, I was like, okay, yeah, I have a headache too. I'm most likely gonna get sick. I had a bright idea to take two Benadryls <laughs> <laughs> and some Excedrin, because I said, there's no way I'm getting sick. I still gotta get home. I gotta get myself to the gym. Like, Hold on, this is us going to work. We were going to work. I was going to work. I was like three hours. No, I'm not even like two hours in. I was like, dude, like I cannot stay awake. I was literally like on my computer, like, and <laughs> me and Anna work in the same office. She comes over to to, to my cubicle. Her eyes are like bloodshot red. She's like, dude, <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> I literally like call myself. You know when you're like, oh. <laughs> Power nap. Sitting down, I was, it was so bad. I was like, why did I do that? And I told her in the morning, I was like, don't take the bandage, it was gonna get you sleepy. Don't take it. It's never done that to me before. And the thing is that I had taken it the night, oh yeah, so Thursday night when I was gonna go to the gym, I was already feeling kind of like a headache also. So I said, you know what? I'm taking two Benadryl and an extension and I'm hitting the gym. And I didn't feel anything. I don't know if it's because I mixed it in with the pre-workout and everything else yeah. I had. I'm having electric. <laughs> <laughs> I was on fire <laughs> the first day at the gym. I honestly want to try this this bread, but you don't even uh, so eat I'm it. not gonna eat the bread because I don't eat bread like that. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? But, um, yeah, try it. That makes no sense. So we got here, this is a this is a because I told him you should have at least gotten the cheese one. I know, I messed up. And honestly, I'm I would have eaten the cheese. Well, no, I'm pretty sure it was just sprinkled on there. I, I, and pro I don't know, I had it in the car and then I, I, I took one of them out. So this is a garlic nun. <laughs> <laughs> it's a garlic nun. <laughs> Not a nun. Non. Look, I'm going to put this disclosure. We're eating it nuns today. <laughs> <laughs> Vaseline, what's the movie from the nun, the scary one? No, so, I want to put a disclosure. Because, well, I know punks know something about this, but disclosure, if I mispronounce anything, keep in mind, English is my second language. And why do you have to put a disclosure? Because, well, I don't know, man. I mean, I'm gonna mispronounce everything, I know for sure. I mispronounced everything in English in the first place. Luego hablo español y no tartamudeando. Yo no sé hablar. Y no nos dieron dos, tú no vas a probar. 
You're gonna just pick it up all like that and eat it like a tortilla? So I guess I'll try garlic. Naan. Naan. I mean, it's all right, like. Honestly, it tastes like a tortilla. It is, it's flatbread. It's just... This is really fun, the cilantro. I, no, I don't think I, it's cilantro. I don't think it's cilantro either, but <laughs> I can't even taste the garlic. So I think the, the one that I've always seen people try and I've always wondered, and it kind of, honestly to me, it scares me, is that. Is that like mole? Like, <laughs> I don't know, like, I, it intimidates me. I, I don't know, it's trying for it's dip your bread in there. And Why do I? Why am I the test dummy? So this is the the chicken tiki masala. Tikka masala? Not tiki. Honestly, so far. <laughs> so far I'm liking everything. But I mean we haven't really tried We haven't tried the main the stuff. Main we, stuff. Dude, we've tried one thing in a dessert. Of course you're gonna like the freaking yogurt drink. This is bomb, dude. I just think that if it was crushed in with some ice, it would be better. It's the most popular dish in India. This is a specific place we got the food from. Every time we go to the shopping center near there, you can smell the it. smell is so potent that it kind of grosses me out. I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's too many, like, I don't even know how to describe this. I feel like it just, like, it just, like hits you. It's just so strong. Yeah. Like, I don't know what to pinpoint what it is. I don't know. Jesus <laughs> <laughs> Why am I so afraid to try People it? mix it, like grab a spoon of the rice and mix it in with the rice, I think. Mm -hmm. Dude, dump it in there! Ah, yeah, chingas my. I got a fucking onion. <laughs> It's that smell. I just can't. I don't know what the what the taste. So is. it it's the smell that we smell. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> oh, I, just I really want to try the chicken though. It doesn't taste like chicken in that it's, smell. There's not. There's a lot of butter in this. A lot. It's thick. But it's not. It does not taste bad. Well, the onion tastes good. I'm a white boy. Oh my god. That's good. Dude, the chicken melted in my mouth. So that was that. They just don't know. Mm-hmm. I got a big ass piece of chicken. A mí sí me gustó. Por lo que voy a hacer, voy a comerme esto, voy a comer una mordida del nada. Yo put in here. Yo put in there. No, me deja hacer en there. Tiene que comer piece of that. No, but. Yeah, but we can make it part of that roll. Mix it in. I guess I'm just gonna go with dirty. This is right. You put a little bit in there and mix it together. Mm-hmm. Good? That was very good. Good? The whole combo together? Yeah. How it needs to be? That's good. No. <laughs> That's good. Honestly, it tasted like it tasted like mole. It's just missing that spice. Mole from Mexico. It that's what it's giving me. Like. Okay. It tastes like mole. Ah, that was good. Honestly, this little mixture like mix how it's supposed to be. Honestly, the smell is so deceiving. But once you put it in. You gull it and you palate. That doesn't smell to me or taste like that smell. Though. To me, this is like the smell because I can I can taste it in my. Can you guys believe this? Aria, you guys saw the video. I already turned three years old already. We were about to roll her into pre K. I can't believe this. My little baby Aria gonna be going to pre K, man. What she was. She was going to. But we we chose not to. <laughs> I don't know. No, the reason why we didn't is, I mean, there's a few things, you know, they have, she's not fully, I don't feel like she's fully ready for it yet. She does like tell us, especially lately, I feel like she tells us a lot of things like what she, like she'll have more like kind of like a conversation. Oh, we can't even cuss around anymore. <laughs> there is, there is, she said shit. Oh yeah, the, this guy said shit, she said shit. And I was like, no, don't, there's another thing. Earlier, earlier, 
he was singing a song. What? <laughs> she was over here singing after him. I'm like, okay, no. What it was it? You can say it if you want. I was singing a song before Sarah Gida, like, Seca Ta Victoria. And then I was like, Seca Ta Victoria. Yeah, I'm just like, okay. Okay. I was like, no, 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 no. So. Anna was like, Ari, te tienes que cantar los cinco, cinco changuitos. <laughs> I was like, hey, you remember the Cinco Chonitos song we were singing? We sing uh, at night, let's sing that one instead. And then because I told her no, non-stop. Get Victoria! Get Victoria! Like, non-stop. I know a lot of people are gonna say, oh, you know, like, it's good for their learning. I was just telling him how she, her, a lot of people always would say that it was to not teach her, but it, she she knows both English and Spanish. Sometimes people will be like, oh, you know, don't put English, this and that, because she's gonna forget the Spanish. And it's honestly, I was telling her it's so crazy how I don't know how we she's, do it. She speaks Spanish. She speak yeah, she does for for one. That's true. But for us too, and we did try it, and it just it couldn't happen because this guy <coughs> does not make it make sense how he is full on Mexican, more Mexican than me, even though it, it doesn't look Ten, like it. Tengo los palos y una frente, yes, man. but he sucks at Spanish. So I think that's And honestly, I'm a certified translator. I don't know how you got that. And I can... Probably. He sucks at Spanish, so it's just hard to communicate with this guy in Spanish. Like, ah. I'm just like, okay, I have a just let problem. it out in English, okay? Let, just, what, what are you going to say? Give it to me straight, like... <laughs> I have a stutter. I have a speech impaired where I stutter both in English and Spanish, but for some for some reason I stutter more in Spanish. And it honestly is really annoying because every time I talk to your parents, I don't know why I stutter so much. And I and, I, and then I, I'm talking to her dad, and I'm here stuttering, and her dad is staring at me like. I feel like in his head it's like. Hoy o mañana. <laughs> Exactly. I feel like that is like <laughs> Having two toddlers is wild. These guys are like, why don't we go for the third? I'm like, excuse me? Do you not see what goes on every afternoon? Like <laughs> as soon as Ian started to walk, it was game over. I haven't had a moment of peace since then. One of them has to be asleep while the other one's awake or else there's no peace in this house. Yeah. Or Addy has or one of them has to be sitting down eating here, the other one over here. That's the only moment of peace. Because, he's a part because of the if they're or? together playing, they'll they'll play together for a little bit, but they're just fighting like constantly. Intermission, okay? Because it's getting, getting a little cold. Okay, We're gonna so try the. Honestly, this looks like some like alabada. Like it's looking a little crusty now. <laughs> alabada. Alabada. <laughs> No, no, es que Man, mira, mira, yeah. mira, trae su limón. Eso es como carne para tacos. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Con su cebolla. No, son como tacos al pastor, no sé qué, no sé. This one is a chicken tikka. Chicken tikka. So not chicken tikka masala, just chicken tikka. The masala is right there. This is just... That one looks good, honestly. Tikka. Tinka. I'm going to take it como tinka to mano. It has yogurt on it. But it has yogurt on it? It has yogurt on it. It's probably like marinated with yogurt. Yeah, marinated with yogurt, spiced yogurt. Just okay. spicy yogurt. Grass on this. Let's cheers to this. Honestly, I'm, I don't I don't know if my taste buds are gone. I don't know what's going on. That's sad that the Anna's taste buds are gone because... This is a big old piece of chicken, dude. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's the same thing. Mm -hmm. It's like the chick chicken tikka masala. It's good though. Dude, why would you get chicken tikka and then chicken tikka masala? Does that not ring a bell in your head? It's the same thing minus that? I told, I showed Anna the order. We were upstairs. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, it's fine. Come on, man. Pero va a ver echa que limoncito. I fucking love them, dude. I'm gonna dip it in the pesto. Is this how? <laughs> Are you supposed to eat this like this? A <laughs> I don't know. I'm regretting my decision. Does that have oil in it? Everything has oil. Estoy a dieta. Mira la estética. Me veo así porque estoy haciendo las cosas bien. Mira la estética. It's good, but I'm, I'm, I'm really annoyed right now. This is not a good review then. Why? We basically only tried chicken tikka masala because this is just the chicken without the sauce. I'm gonna get my protein in for the day. 
Y vas a hacer un mal fucking shake. Salud. Bendiciones. I have a daughter, Joe. Wow, as fuck. If you're not a parent, if you, don't have, if you only have one kid, just try it. Have another one. I just feel like, how do you not, you have to give your kid a sibling. To think that your kid is never gonna, okay, maybe, I don't know, maybe I shouldn't say this. <laughs> I don't, I don't know people getting mad, but how are you not gonna give your kid a sibling? You, it's because especially if you have like a, like if you're a girl, you know what it's like to have a sister. Unless you really have like a shitty, horrible sister, not my experience. I wouldn't know. But you know, you know when you used to like, you know when you used to steal your sister's shit, and then she would be so mad, and you would still keep it anyway, <laughs> or just all those like dumb little fights, you know, like. I used to steal my brother's stuff all the time. One time I went to school, and I put on his Jordans. He got home. He got your ass. He and I had a cell phone, right? He called me. Hey, wait, didn't these Jordan puertos? Hell yeah. Oh, they see, pero estoy en la escuela. Y dijo tu perra madre. He was fucking mad. Yeah, that was all my experience. I would usually be like, no, I don't have it. I, it's in my closet. Don't go searching. <laughs> but I think it's that. Because you know, there's also those people that say like, oh yeah, I've had a boy first and the boy was completely normal and then the second child was born and they're just wild. So I don't really think it's a boy thing. I think... But then even anybody says that our kids are just something else. We were, I don't even think they're that bad. We were at your cousin's wedding. Every other kid is chilling. <laughs> we're over here running wild in this case, man. And we're just... Everybody is... Their kids are just having a good, jolly time. Here's Ian rushing to the back. He has an obsession with being on the back side where nobody's at. He's like taking off to the back and then Addy is just over here jumping on kids, throwing rocks at kids. Throwing rocks at kids, dirt at kids. And I'm just like, dude, like. She punches, and then she he, punches your cousin's daughter right in the face, dude. She, they were trying to fight over this thing that it was like a plain They had a thing, soft plate. A soft plate thing. And Addy wanted that piece of the soft plate and Addy, Anna's cousin's daughter had it. Addy doesn't hit like this, yo. Addy will punch you. Addy is straight up just punches this girl right in the face. She's just like, boom. I didn't see that. I saw it. You can ask Erasmo. You can ask your Polo. They all saw it. Okay, you're saying this like you're proud. This is not a good thing. Well, it's not, but it's, it's just, dude, it's really, there's a lot of things these kids do. It's really hard not to laugh. Because oh, yeah. you're like, how is this little person able to do this? How? Where that, are you, yeah, but where that's are you getting that from? That's not that funny, dude. That's aggressive. Chill. I don't know. I thought it was a little funny. I mean, it was, did you, you know, get her in trouble? I believe I did. That's not like a no to me. I believe I did. I believe anyway, I did. Anyway, that wasn't yeah, that funny. It could have been self-defense. What? What is some papas? It looks like, it looks like fish. <laughs> you know when you get a fish at the fair? <laughs> It, those are all the containers you get them in. That's what I'm saying. That's how you get a fish to the fair. This is a, this is a dessert. Gulab Janum. Gulab Janum. <laughs> <laughs> they were butchering all this stuff, dude. Gulab. Gulab. Gulab Janum. Gulab. That's what I just said. Gulab. It's Gulab. Gulab. Gulab Janum. This is a popular Indian dessert that's made from milk, solid flour, and leaving a. But how to pronounce it? I want to hear it. It's Gulab. I just don't know the second one. Press. Please. Gulab jamin. Gu gulab jamin. I was right. Gu gulab gulab jamin. Okay. Gulab jamin. Honestly, you know what this looks like? Oh my god! I feel like I'm getting the vibes that Indian culture food is like Mexican food. You're like authentic. Oh, okay, no, I'm wrong. Sabes que parecían como pedazos de camote cuando los Cuando los cuesos así, that's what it looked like. So we're just using the same dirty old knife on the fork? I, I cleaned it with, with this. It would it so it's rice? No. It looks like a fruit. It's a popular in this shirt that's made from milk, solid flour, and leave it in a leave-in agent. The balls are fried into golden brown and soaked in sugar, syrup flavor with cardamom rose water. Cardamom. Cardamom. And rose water. This is this is weird. You know, I thought this was fruit. Okay. It was a popular one. Oh yeah. <gasps> Oh. Ooh. I'm, I'm a little upset because I don't know if it's not. I was expecting stronger flavors, so I don't know if my. This is. Honestly, is this is really strong flavors. Oh, damn. I just taste sugar. What does it taste like? Como un pancake, pero remojadísimo. Super stoked. <laughs> That's the only thing. That, I don't know, man. I don't press the fork, but for me, it's supposed to. Dude, this is like pancakes 
just covered in syrup, like a really strong syrup. Like a sugar. Mm -hmm. Now I can feel the sugar. I don't know if it was a fork. Drink the water. Fuck. <laughs> no, I'm not even that. You're gonna start feeling like all like, you know, like when you haven't had sugar in a long time and you just start like. When we take, when we take the kids to my mom's house, my mom be like, I know to see who doesn't stand in path, but your mom's not a can of sugar. You guys don't want to stand in path? I know to see who saw me. I know that the camera pila ten una cookie. Ten un pan. Ay, le, le voy a hacer cake. Dude, pues que piensas? Aquí no comen nada de eso. Tú les das? Se van a ir, man. Man, a meter el pinche día. Come for cow. Dude, like, ama. Tú me das tu número de video. Capta la cosa. Es por eso que hacen eso. Why does this look like clam chowder? Dude, está. <laughs> ah, man. Me muy asco. <laughs> oh, my God. ¿Qué es esto? It's cottage cheese. No te gusta? Rasmalai. Rasmalai. Dude, why didn't you look at the description? Why would you get a dessert made from cottage cheese? Just try it. I like cottage cheese. Honestly, if you don't like cottage, cottage cheese, it's supposed to have a lot of protein, I think. It has sugar, nuts, cordine, milk, saffron, cardamom. Cardamoms? Why did you say that? <laughs> I don't know how to say that shit, man. Try it. If not, eso se arregla con agarrar cottage cheese. Put it in a little vasito. Echale un chingo de valentina. Yucky, mama. Okay, agarra una pelotita. No, parte la mitad. No, 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 agarra una pelota tú. Oh, Jesus Christ. Una, dos, sí. Pero chingatelo todo. No, chingatelo todo. Uno no. You're gonna let a dessert take you out? Pero. It's fine. Pero que sabe? I don't know. I wanna see my taste buds are gone. Yeah, that's a go. Pan. I don't know. To me, honestly, I know reality is the texture. It's just too soaked on that. <laughs> it's too soaked on the liquid stuff. It's just too wet. It's like, too like. You know, like when you eat a, a galleta con pan? I don't understand. A galleta con pan. I don't understand. Is this cottage cheese or not? It says it's made out of cottage cheese. No. To me, the desserts were no go. I'm sorry. Both of them were no go to me. You guys know what else happened this week? Was it last week? No, it's been a week. Something cool, guys. You guys are not gonna believe this. Anna made a TikTok. <laughs> Go follow her TikTok. Anna's funny, y'all. Our sense of humor is really different. Really, really different. How? Because you say the, the way that I, what I find funny is stupid. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Let me elaborate. I don't know. I'm funny, funny. I like funny, funny. He likes funny, stupid. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think I'm naturally just funny. But you, like, you'll show me videos and it's like a guy getting in the head, hit in the head with a bat. And he's like, for example, laughing. What the fuck? It, this is an example. He'll be like fucking laughing. I'm just sitting here like, this is stupid. First of all, I, I do not think I do not think somebody get in with a bat. Find me, find me a TikTok that you think is funny right now. No. Exactly. I don't know. Okay, so that's a bad reference. Okay, his sense of humor is like shit. <laughs> I don't know. Wow. <laughs> no, what? Okay, I like funny, funny. If it's funny, I'm gonna laugh. But if it's like that, that and then she'll recreate it and make it that, on TikTok. <laughs> that made up funny stuff where you're trying too hard to be funny, I or that faked that. out like funny videos, like I don't find that funny. But with all that being said, we come to the conclusion that um, Mauricio sucks. Um, he's not that funny. What you mean? I'm joking. But with all that being said, I'm the funny one here. <laughs> Okay, look, okay, this is what I'm gonna say about the whole TikTok thing, okay? Go follow my TikTok. I just don't want this information disclosed to like, you know... Your tia. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I saw this one TikTok that said, you know, like... Hey, like, you know, like when, when certain people look at your, your TikTok because TikTok is more like... How do you call it? Like more... Un not uncensored, but you just post like what you think on there, right? Or like... What you find funny. Funny or like, you know, I just record of this video i'm just like why why did your mom comment on this video <laughs> i was working out 
my video, I'm just like, I, I don't want to post workout videos anymore. My, my, my mom commented on the video this, like clapping emoji. And I'm just like, <laughs> it's just hey, my mom's supporting the, the craft. But you know, TikTok isn't for everybody, you know, like TikTok is not what I want. I guess you're the adult family members to be watching. Well, it's like, it's like that one video that I saw where like you're at work and your friend and your co-worker is like, hey, I found your TikTok. Yeah, that too. And it's like, okay, now I'm gonna block you. Yeah, like. That's just weird. Like one day my boss comes up to me and she's like, yeah, I saw you on YouTube. And I'm just like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, okay. Like, she's like, yeah, I've never heard you talk that much. <laughs> I'm just like, oh yeah, like I'm just here to work. I'm here to put my time in, do my work, and go out. I guess go follow TikTok. You know what? Go follow TikTok. Go follow it. I dare you. <laughs> yeah, so I can get more followers. <laughs> Pretty long. I feel like it's gonna be long. We just a mí it. me gusta hablar. Okay, so. Hey. But, but pero dijo tu aside boss, from my bosses, <laughs> a mí me gusta hablar. Estamos en confianza. Estamos en confianza. Estamos en confianza. Hey, we hit 10,000 subscribers. Estamos en confianza, okay? Estamos en confianza, eh? 10K no, subscribers. Las abuelas aquí miraron esto. ¿Por qué mi grandma se ve? Oiga, mija, yo la miro en la tele. ¿Cómo salen en la tele? I was like, grandma, thank you for supporting, though. Thank you for supporting. Shout out to Ana's grandma. Shout out to Ana's grandma. <laughs> But guys, with that being said, guys, thank you so much for 10,000 subscribers. We are so happy and grateful. Thank you so much. That is insane. Like I said, I don't think I don't think I'm gonna get off this high like 10k. I don't. What do you feel about hitting 10k? I'm I'm thrilled, man. He's on a high right now. I'm on a high right now, man. 10,000 subscribers, 10k. I'm what did Gypsy so Gypsy Rose say? I'm on a high right now. Can't bring me down. I'm on a high. <laughs> I'm on a high right now. You can't bring me down, man. 10k subscribers. What's up, y'all? I'm gonna do that video like with Chris Brown. Mm, okay. Live, right. Stop the video. Do it. Do it. Right. Stop the video, somebody. <laughs> Anybody? Please fuck it up. Qué sientes? It's like that Chris Brown shit he does. Yeah, he let him do it. Bye guys. With that being said, thank you so much for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed us trying Indian food. Go try it out if you guys haven't. We wanted to try this for one time, we finally did it. I did mess up and got the same dish kind of twice, you, but... You didn't, kind of. It's the same dish, okay? It's just missing the sauce. But go try it out for yourself. <laughs> if you guys like Indian food, if you guys want to try it out, if you guys wanted to try it out, honestly, some of the stuff, like I said, it was good. And the syrups were a no-go for me. I'm sorry. They were, they were too sweet. Like, if you love sweet, then yeah. Honestly, the white one, that one, it wasn't even that bad. You are exaggerating. I hate that you did. I hate how it's Exaggerated, you are. Okay. It wasn't honestly that bad. This is. Hey, we hit 10,000 subscribers, and it's so we talking nothing about crap. Man, I hate this man. I hate the way that you walk. Damn, man. Like, you just talking crap on me. But anyway, it wasn't even that bad. It's just that they're really sweet, especially this one. These fried balls and syrup, holy shit, that's like, that's diabetes in a cup. Dude, I don't want nothing to do with that. It was good, it wasn't bad. This one is a little bit different because it's like spongy, but anyways, just try it yourself. It's good, it's yeah. delicious, it's awesome. This one was good. El yogur estaba rico, el yogur, la malteada de mango. La malteada de mango estaba buena. Una... You say the Chobani Greek yogurt so you get that are drinkable. Yeah, because it's thick. I think everything is mostly made with yogurt though. Everything has yogurt. Except, Does that have yogurt? Except the naan. Well, I hope you guys like this video. If you're, if you're new and you're watching this and you stick to this long in the video, subscribe. Go follow my TikTok. <laughs> Follow on his TikTok, subscribe. You know, you, you'll be, you were at 10K, it will be higher than what you subscribe. Like the video, drop a comment, share it out to the world. We appreciate you guys, we love you guys, and like always, we'll see you guys on the next one. Deuces, deuces.